Have you ever wondered why rivers flow faster after it's rained? Or why we build dams in rivers? Or have you ever considered how does your height affect your blood pressure? Or what happens to a diver as they take a deep dive? In this topic, we'll be considering these questions. We are going to be investigating the factors that affect how fast rivers flow. We'll see that many of these same factors can also be used to describe other flows, such as the flow of blood through the human body. We'll start by looking at pressure. We'll consider how the pressure changes on a diver as he descends or ascends in deep water. Next, we'll be looking at fluid flow. We'll be covering a couple of equations, one about the volume flow rate and another one which is called Bernoulli's equation. After learning a little about these fluid flow equations, we'll be looking at biological applications of these formulas because you can actually use these same formulas to describe how blood pressure changes in the humans and also what happens when an aneurysm forms in our bodies. Finally, we're going to be looking at dams and how dams can be used as a relatively environmentally friendly way of generating and storing electricity. Dams convert gravitational potential energy of the water into electrical energy. I hope that you enjoy this topic and that you learn a lot from it.